Now, after that uh, unsatisfactory conversation with Miss Gwyn, I don't even know who she is. I doubt she even works at the bank. I'll call their whole complaints hotline and see what happens there. Commonwealth Bank complaints hotline. ago, I wrote it directly to him, um, yep. uh, his email address, uh, ceo.cba.com, I think it is on memory, but uh, uh, it went with Phil Branch at uh, Sydney. Do you know where went with Phil is? Yep, yep. Yeah, uh, they refused to re- reactivate my passport. So I wrote to Mr. Cayman, thinking that that's a bit uh, unfair and unreasonable. And I got a strange letter back today, supposedly from Mr. Cayman, but I don't believe it is. From someone called Frances Margaret A-Z-A-L-O Gwyn. Uh, it seems to be a bit of a... Uh, bit of a dodgy letter and uh, you know I wrote to Mr Mr Cayman directly and, and um, this this letter that I got from uh, Francis uh, Miss Gwynne uh, I, I, I don't think she works at a bank either that or she's a hired gun her address is uh, number four slash or unit four thirty seven Gowry Avenue Punchbowl, New South Wales two one nine six, and uh, uh, you know I wrote as I say uh, I wrote to Mr Cavins and I got this yeah. this very peculiar letter back. So can you assist me with this matter? Yeah, no worries. I can certainly have a look into this one for you today. Can I just confirm it for me?
for in this letter from, from, from Mr. Kerman. Yeah, but before I get out, let's look into that there, George. I think you can tell me I did. Well, I'm on the database, so I don't don't know what more you want. I'm not trying to get any money. I've explained to you what's going on, and you should be able to pull it up on your file there. Yeah, but for that, I need to get yourself identified first, please, George, if that's okay. Well, why don't you send me a, on my mobile phone, send me a, a text. I don't have that available here, George, unfortunately. Well, I'll give you my number and you can do it. Uh, I won't be able to do that, George, unfortunately. I do apologise about that. Okay. Sounds like you're playing hardball. Why are you playing hardball for? I'm not trying playing hardball there, George. This is just the identification procedure there, that's all. Well, okay. What do you want me to do? I can't remember my first boss's name. You can have a guess, that's fine. There's no issues with that one there. My first boss? Yeah. I don't think that ever come into the picture, the, 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 the name of the first pet, but not the boss. So I think, you, you know, you're misleading me there, mate. I'm sorry you feel that way there, George, but that's... Well, that's what it looks like. Yeah. That's what it looks like to, to me. Uh, yeah, that's okay. If can I speak to someone who's got a higher status than you? I won't be able to escalate the call any further than... Well, I'll have to I'll have to call back again and, and try to get someone else in. Yeah, that's fine, George, if you wish to do that, that's fine. Well, I don't wish to do it, but you, you, you sound like you're trying to fob me off. You obviously know all I'm trying to do is clarify this letter from Mr. Comans. Yeah. So you, you're trying to shield me off. Definitely not there, George. Well, that's what it looks like. Well, well, I don't want you to lodge any complaint, mate. I just want to clarify this letter. Yeah. So, where's the letter from? I'll see if I can give you any general information around that. You said it was from... Email letter. It's an email letter, okay? Mm -hmm. Yeah. You should have it on your system. Yes, but... Okay, no, no, no. Well, I'll just... I'll just tell you, okay. Mm -hmm. I'll just uh, pull this up for you. Uh, you seem like an intelligent sort of bloke. Yeah. I got this email letter this morning. Mm -hmm. I think it's a it's a bodgy. Well, it may not be the way you people operate there. Yeah, I'll give you the case number. You want the case number? Yeah, that'd be great, thank you. Okay. Uh, it is uh, CF hyphen double one seven two one four six one C for Charlie. Thank you. I'm just going to bring up those details now there, George. Won't be a moment, okay? Fantastic, mate. Too, too, too easy. Given you all the information, what's your full name? I can only tell you my first name, though, George. You're, okay. very, you're very secretive. Well, okay. Now, what more do you want? Yep, sir. That's what I was asking you. Oh, hang on. I'll get. I'll, I'll see if I can give you this card I've got here. Yeah.
Look, 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 I've provided you all the details and, and you're refusing to cooperate. Every time I provide you the details, I provide you the account, then you think of some other excuse. Are you going to, are you going to, are you going to do something in this matter or are you just going to string me along? Before I can do anything there, Josh, before we can discuss this complaint reference number you have given me, I need to confirm your identity. Over yes, I've already provided you the account number, the date of birth, my phone number, okay, everything. I don't have to tell you any more than that, okay? Sorry about that one there, Josh, but I still haven't been able to fully identify you. Well, 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 what more do you want to know? What more do you want to know? So that's the last question I was asking you. Any transfer purchases or withdrawals in the last seven days that you could confirm the details of? Look, that, that's irrelevant to this complaint. And, and that's, that's irrelevant. You've got the details. All I'm ringing about is the letter I wrote to the CEO, Mr. Comans, uh, to get my passbook reinstated. So, so why are you interrogating me like this for? No, no, you've already, I've already identified myself, mate, thoroughly. You haven't. So are you going to, are you going to assist in this matter or I'm just going to hang up and keep calling? I can assist you, Major. Well, okay, well, go ahead and do it, okay? I'm losing patience with you. <coughs> now, go ahead. What happened with this, this letter I got? I gave you the reference number. Yeah, so before I can confirm or discuss that with you, I need to get yourself identified. I've already done, you're like, you're like a robot, a broken record. Okay, buddy, I'm going to end this call, mate. I, I'll post it up on YouTube. See you later. Sorry about that one, Luke. Fucking idiot. Now uh, we'll call again. Commonwealth Bank's complaints hotline. Hopefully you won't get the same robot. Welcome to the Commonwealth Bank. We value our customers' feedback. For <laughs> feedback relating to transactions and savings accounts, cards, net bank, combank app, disputes, or to provide general feedback, press 1. For home loans, press 2. For personal loans, press 3. For general insurance, including home, content and motor products, press 4. Or for anything else, press 0. First, I'll get some details from you. If you have your NetBank client number with you, please key it in now, followed by the hash key. And if you don't know it, just press hash. Okay, if you know your card number, press 1. And if you have any other account number, press 3. Otherwise, if you don't have either of these, just press hash. Just a moment. To ensure our high standards of customer service are maintained, this call may be monitored or recorded for training purposes. All our telephone staff are currently busy. Please hold and we'll assist you as soon as possible. Pause this and be waiting here forever for me. Again, I'll just pause it. I'll probably get the same stooge back. What a corrupt bank this is. Yeah, obviously, they're not going to come back. This, they're only going to get the same stooge come back. So, uh, I've given, given him the, the account number, date of birth, address, phone number. See so how they can steal your identity. Even just delete your bank account. It is cancel culture. Complaints, they don't take them. Cancel it. Very politely, they cancel it. Just delete your whole savings. That's what they could do if they wanted. Thank you for waiting. We appreciate your patience and we'll be with you as soon as possible. Very 
bad out of control. Little Putin saw them. children and just hang it up. God help your children.